I didn't have the heart to charge the one because I didn't know exactly what was going on with it, so. So, I know I haven't posted in like a week, and I'm really sorry about that, you guys, but my channel kind of relies on outside forces. If I don't find any games, I really don't have a video. I mean, I could just kind of do like daily vlogging, but it's not really what the channel is about. It's kind of about what I find. So, with that being said, I did find a couple of good things. Everything I found this week was free, which is kind of crazy. I never find free stuff. But I just wanted to fill you guys in. Like, if I don't post for a week, it's because I haven't really found anything. Uh, follow me on Instagram. I do get some pickups that I just don't record given certain situations. Like, if it's an inside guy or, you know, if the lady doesn't want me to record or whatever, I won't record. But I'm very thankful for the few things that I did find. And I just wanted to fill you guys in on why I haven't posted for over a week. And with that being said, let's get into this week's pickups. One thing that I do is I go on Facebook Marketplace and I type in garage sale and I'll literally copy paste the exact same message to every single garage sale listed. It'll say, hello, do you have any old video games? I'm looking for Sega, Nintendo, Super Nintendo 64, Game Boy, GameCube, PlayStation, and sometimes they'll actually respond. So right here, classic example, she has a garage sale listed and I asked her, hello, do you have any old video games? Nintendo, Super Nintendo 64, PlayStation. She said, not really, I'm giving away a Nintendo Wii with two games. It's free because I'm not 100% sure it works. I think the games do, but the console needs an update. I told her, I'll take it, I fix them if they don't work. Okay, are you able to pick it up on Friday or Saturday? My address is in the ad. Um, there's lots of people that message these ads, so I always try to make the deal happen right here, right now. I told her I'm free every day, do you mind if I pick it up before the sale? I'm free tonight and tomorrow as well. Anytime works, I guess, where are you located? I'm in Richfield, Bloomington is really close to me. Okay, let me know, I can meet, I can meet too, up to you. I can meet now if you're free. Okay, where do you wanna meet? So anyways, I'm not sure what game she has with it, but I'm excited. She said it's a special edition Red Wii, and if it works, I'm definitely keeping it. Hey. Hello, how you doing? Good, how are you? Doing great. I appreciate you meeting up with me tonight before the sale. Yeah, no problem. I'm glad you like me uh, messaged me because I've had so many messages about video games and no oh, one's really? interested in this, but I mean, I have the manuals, everything's in like mint condition. A couple of rechargeable battery packs. Y yeah, I'll hook it up at home and see, you know, if it's working yeah. or what the deal is with it. Yeah, the charging base, um, I think there was some issues with that. It was like flashing really fast and it wasn't charging very well and then I used to stream Netflix through the Wii, and it said we can't hook up to internet because it needs an update, the console needs oh, an update. Oh, okay. Yeah, that would do it. So, I think that's all, though. The game still worked. The gaming did. Okay. Yeah, well, I definitely appreciate you meeting up with me. Yeah. I, I, look, I look forward to this. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't have the heart to charge the one because I didn't know exactly what was going on with it, so. Okay. Well, if I get home and it's all working, maybe I'll kick you 10 bucks over a cash app or something. Whatever you can do with it. I haven't even, it's been in storage for like four years. Well, if you come across anything else, definitely shoot me a message. I'm willing to pay for this stuff. <laughs> I got a whole bedroom full of it. I saw like in the background of your profile picture, I'm like, he's got a lot of games. That's just one wall, trust me. <laughs> it's a whole bedroom, wall to wall. Do you wall. sell it or do you just play? Well, what I do is I like to find lots like garage sales, thrift shops. Mm -hmm. I'll sell what I don't have and keep the rest. Try, yeah. try to offset the cost a little bit. Yeah. Cool. And I love the special edition red too. That's one it, reason I kept it. So it's long. pretty cool. I'll <laughs> definitely sell my white one and keep the red one. Are you serious? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> like right. you said, a special edition. That's awesome. So, well, enjoy it, and yeah, I'm glad I found someone that really wanted it. Yeah, I appreciate it a lot. Yeah, I'm no pretty into it. I got even like a Zelda shirt. <laughs> Yeah, that's awesome. Well, thanks so much. Yeah, no problem. You have, have a great night. night. She said she had other people message her about video games, so I just assume there's lots of people doing what I do and messaging every garage sale ad. But, I mean, for free, I'm still going to take a shot at it. She said it just needs an update and it still plays games. So, I'll end up uh, keeping this red one. I'll box mine back up into the box and put it up on the shelf, and I'll just keep the red one for everyday use. But, yeah, we got Wii Sports and Wii Sports Resort. So, 
Should be able to make some money on those. Put this red Wii into the collection for free. The controller has motion plus too, that's awesome. Back at the house, I just want to hook up this red Wii and see if it's working. All right, so we got the red Nintendo Wii with a bunch of booklets and stuff, two games, controller. I'm not gonna use these cables. I'm just gonna plug it into the cables that I already have right here. I'm just gonna unhook my Wii and plug this one in. So, so yeah, let me do that real quick. All right, I've hooked up the Wii. I use the Wii to HDMI. Looks like it's got power. Well, it powers on. Just because it powers on doesn't mean it works. So let's try one of these games. This one's pretty scratched. I might have to run it through my machine. Hey, looks like it's working to me. All right. Dang, one left. <laughs> My ball likes to curve left, so I like to go pretty far right. spare well the nintendo wii works i'm definitely going to sell the white one i have and just use the red one i love that special edition red it's a really awesome looking color um it also came with wii sports resort and wii sports i'm not going to put that stuff into price charting i think we can all agree that this is worth more than you know free so yeah got pretty dang lucky on that one on to the next so this very nice lady reached out to me on Facebook yesterday. Her name is Nicole. She said, hey, I have some Nintendo 64 games. I'm not sure what I have, but I'll check when I get home. I said, awesome, I look forward to seeing what you have. She sent me a picture of Super Nintendo games. She said, my house has crappy lighting. This is the best I could get. I told her, that's fine, I can tell what they are. Great, let me know what you're interested in. She said to make an offer, so I offered her 20 bucks, and she said, sure, that's fine, and asked where I was located. So after chatting with her for a little bit, she actually said, you can just have them for free if you're willing to sit down and talk to me for a little bit about YouTube and eBay, because she wants to start getting into it herself. And yeah, I told her that was more than fine. So I told her, I sell anything I can make a dollar on. Video games are a big part of it, though. Thanks for subscribing. She said, that's awesome. I'll tell you what, you can have the games for free if when you pick them up, you take the time to chat with me about what you do and how you've gained so many subscribers. I know there's tons of free content out there about how to utilize YouTube, but I'd so much rather talk to a person who is actively doing it. Yeah, absolutely, I can do that. I enjoy chatting about it. One thing I always wanted to, in life is to find a job that I enjoy and not be miserable every day, if that makes any sense. I can honestly say I found it. I can meet you anytime tomorrow if you're free. The trip is worth it to me. So I'm about to go meet up with this lady. She's gonna give me some Super Nintendo games for free and I'm just gonna chat with her about YouTube and eBay for a little bit, which I enjoy doing. So yeah, let's do it. Hi, Nicole? Yeah. Nice to meet you. Yeah, it's nice to meet you too. How's your day going? Good. Good, good. good. So far, so good. That's what I like to hear. Yes. You have tattoos, that's fantastic. <laughs> I got lots of them. They go all over. <laughs> yes, that's awesome. My husband and I love tattoos. So what's the deal? These were yours from when you were a kid and you just don't play them? So actually, my husband works for a place that has storage units. 
Okay. And they, part of his job, unfortunately, is if people don't pay their storage unit, then they just keep the yeah. stuff that's in there. Yeah, and he was going to throw them away. And I'm like, I really think you should keep them. I think that somebody is going oh, to. Oh, that hurts them. my soul. Throw them away. <laughs> yeah. Well, we don't have like a system to play them. So I was like, I really think we should keep them. Either they're going to be worth a lot of money someday or someone's going to want them. And somebody wants them. So. Yeah, I'm always willing to pay for this stuff too. So if yeah. you come across anything, definitely shoot me a message. I cool. can give you a business card. Awesome. Yeah, for sure. I totally will. So, yeah. Do you have any questions or? I would love to know how you do what you do. What an awesome lady. She was so nice to me. I can't believe that, you know, she just gave me these games for free and wanted to sit down and talk about YouTube. Uh, Nicole, if you start your YouTube channel, I really wish you a lot of luck. I'll shout you out on my channel anytime. She said that her husband does storage units and they come across this stuff all the time. So I gave her a business card and I told her to reach out to me if she ever comes across anything else. But we've got Donkey Kong 3, College Football, Killer Instinct, Wolverine, Super Mario Kart, and NBA Hang Time. One thing about collecting video games is just talk to these people. Let them know you're a collector, be real personable with them. Most people will be really nice and talk back and sometimes they're just looking to get rid of this stuff because to them, it's just old video games. They don't care about it as much as we care about it. Like she said, she just wanted to get rid of them and her husband was gonna throw them away. But to me, I'm willing to pay cash for them and I told her that. I'm gonna go ahead and end the video right here. As always guys, thank you for watching, thank you for subscribing, and on to the next.